Hey, what's going on, guys? Mush back at it with another video. Want to go over the two freebies on EGS right now, as well as next week's freebie. Next week's freebie, probably a game a lot of you guys don't know about, but it's a really, really good game. So we'll talk that. Speaking of EGS, a former EGS exclusive has just been released on Steam and Control Ultimate Edition. Now, they've been doing some whack stuff with this game in terms of uh, on consoles, how they're handling the next generation upgrade. Nevertheless, this is a game that I really enjoyed, and this Ultimate Edition was actually released at a very compelling price point, so I'll talk a little bit about that. And Xbox Game Pass, man, oh man, got some more significant updates, so we'll go over that quickly at the end of this video. But right now, over on Epic Game Store, you can get Hitman as well as Shadowrun Collection. Hitman is Hitman 2016, which was a game that was released in an episodic fashion, and I think that really did harm the game quite a bit. Uh, it was a quality title. I thought it was a pretty good Hitman game, but uh, yeah, that episodic release pattern, I think, ended up hurting it quite a bit. Uh, however, if you have, have never checked it out, do give it a download over on EGS, it's a pretty good title. Typically, it goes for five bucks, but you could go uh, get it for free right now. Shadowrun Collection, also very, very good if you want something that's a little bit more story driven, a little bit more tactics based. You got Shadowrun Returns here, Shadowrun Dragonfall, as well as Shadowrun Hong Kong. That's a ton of content. Like, that's a lot of hours of gameplay that you're just getting for free. So definitely two solid freebies here. Uh, Shadowrun and Hitman are also two very distinct experiences, so I feel like they complement each other uh, rather well so you can find the one game that you'll like the most. Uh, Hitman being a more action stealth title, Shadowrun very much a little bit of a slower paced game and it being more story driven so I think you guys can find enjoyment out of both of them depending on what exactly you're looking for. Okay, moving on from that again, Control Ultimate Edition is now available on Steam. I figured that this was going to be released uh, for $59.99, however they actually released it at $39.99 and on top of that there's a 20% off discount not it down to $32. Now, I thought it was going to be $60 because they're including the DLC in this as well. I believe the one DLC isn't even out yet, the one that is uh, uh, the Alan Wake crossover, so that's pretty cool. You get all that content here. And uh, the base control game I thought was really, really good. I played control uh, initially when it came out and I had a really good time with it. I thought it was better than Alan Wake, and I thought it was better than Quantum Break, which is saying quite a bit, because I loved Alan Wake. Quantum Break, not as much, but Control, I thought, was awesome from a gameplay standpoint. I think it really, really upped the quality level from a gameplay standpoint. And then I thought the story was very interesting as well. Loved the main character, just thought there was a lot of good in Control. And if you haven't checked it out, maybe $32 is still a little bit pricey to you. I know you guys have that edict where you say you're not going to buy any uh, former EGS exclusive, and I can understand your thought process thinking that but control was a really good game if you're interested in it in it uh the ultimate edition for 32 bucks i think is pretty good but probably will go on a deeper discount maybe even before the year's up with all of the different sales that are surely going to be happening before the end of 2020 lastly i do want to give you guys a heads up on some xbox game pass updates game pass adds some more major games yesterday they added tell me why which is a brand new uh experience from don't not entertainment it is an episodic franchise but i believe every episode will be on game pass episode one is out right now don't nod the guys that did life is strange so that's pretty good check it out pretty interesting based on the description that i did read hypnospace outlaw is also out very very quirky title there but cool to see that on game pass as well and then today some major additions double kick heroes and then the big one wasteland 3 yes wasteland 3 available directly on xbox game pass this has been getting received really really well like an 86 on metacritic steam reception i think has been incredibly strong yeah very positive 81 percent positive across 264 reviews which is pretty good ign gave it an 8 out of 10 which you know take that for what you will a metacritic 86 uh and seemingly is being received rather well i gotta spend some time and jump into it there's gonna be a little bit of a time sink so waiting a little bit before i play this one but definitely excited to give that one a go and available on game pass makes it even more of a compelling pickup but that's gonna conclude this video again hitman 2016 available free over on egs shadowrun collection available free on egs control ultimate edition available now on steam that's a great game if you don't pick it up now, do add it to your wishlist. I think you're going to have some fun with that when you do ultimately pick it up, if you do. And uh, Game Pass making some more strides. Wasteland 3 on there. Tell me why. Hypnospace Outlaw. Double Kick Heroes. Remember, Flight Sim just got added as well. So Game Pass getting even better than it already was at. That's going to conclude this video. If you guys have a request for a future video, you can leave that in the comment section down below. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.
Hey, what's going on, guys? Mush here again. Hope you enjoyed the video. As you guys might know, YouTube's notification system is sometimes a little bit wonky, even if you're subscribed to the channel. Maybe you're not abundantly aware that I uploaded a video to remedy that situation. Make sure you hit the bell notification button. This way, whenever I upload a new video and I try to upload as consistently as possible, you will be notified directly of the upload and you can watch it as soon as it goes live. I would really appreciate if you guys hit that button so you can stay up to date with all of the content I'm posting. But as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.